Good morning to you. Back to Joshua 2 verse 21. And she bound a scarlet line in the window. Our heading? A dedicated house. I amuse myself by observing how many houses were insured. I noticed the mark of the different insurance companies. Now there was only one house in Jericho that was insured. And that had for its symbol and mark of insurance a scarlet line tied in the window. What a mercy it is when houses are insured by the grace of God and dedicated to the Lord. The very houses and much more the inhabitants of those houses. Firstly, how can you dedicate a house? I was reading the other day that in Cromwell's time, that is in the 1600s, you could go down Cheapside at a certain hour in the morning and you would see the blinds drawn at every house and hear the family singing all the way along for says an old divine in those days a drawn blind was the scarlet line in the window people knew as they passed along that there was an altar erected to god in that house family praying was going on well the practice has gone out of fashion even among many many who profess to be the people of god and secondly I believe that when the house and the church pull together, things are right. But when religion is made to be a thing of the church and not of the house, when the minister is looked to instead of the father, when the man sees to be the priest in his own house, then the very seniors of vital godliness has been cut as application Listen to the words of an old theologian, Matthew Henry. Those who pray do well. You get up to that, I hope. Those that read the scripture and pray do better. Those who read the scriptures and pray and sing do best of all. I think this is the scarlet line with a threefold cord to it. And I would that every house hung out that scarlet line as meaning. This house belonged to King Jesus. The devil need not trouble himself to come here. For the strong man, that is man with a capital M, armed keeps his good in peace. And I pray, O Lord my God, but that every family, slowly but surely, would begin to erect an altar to your glory, in their household. In Jesus' name, Amen.